Okay, so I want to show you what I'm doing today, but at the same time I need to show you what that noise is, and that is uh, Dutchy way over here um, playing in her pool. <laughs> She's having fun with the water. We actually warmed up enough. So, but today what I'm going to do is up pot these. I have all of these trays that had really low germination and um, so I want to the few items that actually germinated and are living and I haven't killed I want to up pot them here in these pots um, and here are some others that we got like one germinating I don't know why that celery um, I've taken some of these out because they actually germinated and I up potted them and what I have here in this bowl is um, some strawberries that had um, the little starts that trail off of them. A friend of ours, um, Chastity and Joel, uh, ran them over to give to me the other day and I didn't have time to pot them. So I just set them in a bowl hoping to keep them fresh until I could do that today. Um, and then... Uh, we just have all of these random things that need to be potted or planted. Um, I've got this right here. These are some of my seedlings. And I've up-potted some, and others need to be up-potted. Another tray that had really low germination. Although, um, I'll show you here in a little bit, I did have really good germination on a lot. So I had success and I had failure but we're just going to count it all as success <laughs> and then right now my greenhouse is at the point where it's getting so hot in here um, when the sun is out like right here um, I don't know if you could read it it is 89 degrees and to tell you the truth I think it gets up to like 120 <laughs> so um, but I got to turn on the fan and all of that kind of stuff but I've emptied all of that to get it all out here to get some sunshine. Um, but now I need to do something with this lettuce because the lettuce, um, it's just too hot for it. These were great in the winter. I had a lot of salads off of them, but now it's time to pull them out. And I think I'm gonna try some hot peppers in here. Since hot peppers like it hot or uh, any kind of peppers like it hot, I'm going to try some different varieties in here and see if I can't get them to grow and if I can keep it cool enough not to kill them, um, but warm enough, maybe I can keep them for a longer season than they normally do. And this is our little kitty, Gracie. She's on a leash because um, she's not quite ready uh, to face the world outside. <laughs> um, so anyways, I'm going to get on with that and get that job done. While I'm out here, take a look at my pretty irises that have bloomed and I wish there was smell-o-vision because these smell just like grape bubblegum or grape soda. And I was on my way to show you the seedlings that actually did work this year and that is all of these seedlings, all of these things I grew from seed. From the alyssum, to the oregano, to the cat mint, which my cat really loves, um, to the cauliflower, to uh, this cherry tomato, which looks very small, but he's gonna take off. Um, to all of these trays. Uh, that I up potted and some that need to be up potted uh, tomatoes and Swiss chard um, parsley um, let's see what else is that that one's catnip also peppers um, I think that's an eggplant I did from seed of course the Swiss chard and the basil and 
even the parsley. And uh, this particular tomato I did. Some of the other tomatoes I actually bought, but these ones I did. Um, and even this zucchini, he was the only one that made it. I was giving him some water because he was looking a little droopy. But all of that from seed. So I'm really, really happy with my uh, greenhouse this year. I think next year it's going to be even more amazing. Okay, it's all ready to plant and I'm going to put some peppers in it to see. I've got the same peppers are in my garden so it's kind of a experiment to see what happens between the two different places and if I can get these to have extended life. And then I've got some, I'll show you here in a minute, um, that we planted in memory of my uh, daughter's uh, little bird um, that passed away pickle. Um, so you'll see it says um, pickles peppers because she said he was spicy. <laughs> so we all planted peppers in memory of him. Um, so I don't know how many, maybe two of each of the different kinds I think is about all I can fit in there because they're going to get bigger if I don't kill them first. And then let me get those other peppers. So as you can see, I have three pots. Um, these ones are bell peppers just like those, so I probably won't do these ones in there. Um, but then a dragon cayenne and a jalapeno. All uh, pic pickles peppers. <laughs> Pickle the birds peppers. So I'll put a couple in here and see how it goes. Wish our little peppers luck. I'm hoping that they do really good. I need to water them in right now really good because it's hot in here. It's already gotten up to 89 and climbing. And we will see about the um, peas. I think they're about done, but I kind of was going to leave them until I can't pick anything more off of them. I have a few more new arrivals in the greenhouse. Um, I have been to the nursery, lol. <laughs> um, so, I have all of my new plants to go into the patio pots. Uh, so, stay tuned for the next video. I'll be potting everything up for those. <laughs> Until next time, until the next video, love you guys. Have a great week.